So, um, well, actually, I'm going to talk about that right now. So, basically, what these are from is this thing called Kid Pick, which, um, as you guys know, in last vlog, which was part four, this is part five, guys. Like, this is becoming a series. Like, COVID-19 vlogs are becoming a series. This is my last week of full school, but back to kid pick um my mom signed me up for my birthday and basically you just pick out everything that you like like um they have like a list of stuff that you can pick and you pick out everything that you like the shirt and my jeans that i'm wearing are also from kid pick and um you can then you get a box every you can decide when you want to get a box we decide to go every six months just to try it out and if we end up really really liking it we're going to be doing it more i guess so um I really like it. It's I got some more stuff there over yonder, but um, right now I thought I would try a chocolate frog because a good way to st I got this for my birthday by one of my friends and a good way to start off a um, a video is by eating a Harry Potter food. I'm actually going to be going to Florida in in wait let me think. I got Gilderoy Lockhart. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm actually going to be going to Florida in April for my dance team. And my, um, in the first few days, it's just going to be me and my mom, and then my sister and my brother, my dad are going to join us. So probably one of those first few days, I'm definitely going to go to Universal and go to the Harry Potter land thing. Let's try a chocolate frog. This is actually my second time trying one. Um, this is the only Harry Potter candy, but I've actually had it twice, so this is going to be great. Mm, just like a Rice Krispie treat in chocolate. I actually tried this. I tried something like this. It's called Crackle. But it's like a Hershey bar with like the rice things. And I think that's what this is. I really like it. I recommend it. Like I said, I got Gilderoy Lockhart. Let me read the back of it. Writer and Hogwarts professor. Wizarding celebrity author Gilderoy Lockhart wrote many books on his encounters with dark creatures and received many awards, including the Order of Merlin, third class, and honorary member of the Dark Force Defense League. After losing his memory in a series of unfortunate events, he released his final book entitled, Who Am I? Yeah, Gilderoy Lockhart, in the second book, lost his memory. Um, I, I feel like this is going to offend some people, but I kind of really don't like him. It's kind of annoying. Okay, guys, I just wanted to say that for right now. I'm going to talk to you guys later. Bye! Parents' house, and a birdie fell from their nest. A birdie fell from its nest. And so they picked him up and put him in a little cage. And the mom still feeds him, but um, they're feeding him a little bit so he does not die. Look at him! Is that not so cute? He's so adorable. They named him Steve, and he's so cute. Um, I just wanted to show you guys that. I thought that was really cool. Bye. Hey, everyone. Um, so I thought I would show you some arts and crafts that I've been working on. Um, I basically did most of them yesterday um, because yesterday we couldn't really go outside or really do anything because it was, like, raining and thunderstorming. But we had a lot of fun inside the house. We made things work. I did a lot of cool arts and craft kits that I didn't really know I had. And we made popcorn, and it was really fun. We got to sit and watch a movie, Star Wars to be exact. And, um, yeah, so I'm going to show you what I've been working on. So in my videos, I made this, like, bed frame, and I was making the bed. So let's just move all these little things. And basically what happened was, um, is the paper underneath, like, the card, like, you know how, like, some film board has, like, two sheets of paper in between? I don't know. Well, the paper started to rip, so the whole bed thing started to rip, so I just kind of, um, redid that, and now it should be all good. Um, so I think I'm gonna actually put some, something, like, in between, like, these two and, oops, and, like, these two to kind of make it, like, a little bit more sturdier for the dolls. And I just used tacky glue to fix it. And these are, this is what I've been using to like hold it in place. And then I also did this cool clay, I forget what it's called. I think it's called, oh, it's the Pottery Cool Clay Set. 
so this is supposed to be the phone case or like the phone like 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 speaker or whatever and so basically what you have to do is you put it like that and then you put your phone right there and then it should like make like a speaker sound so all i really have to do now is just paint it and then i had some extra clay left over so i just made a little heart pencil topper and yeah obviously as you can tell i'm not the best at this so um yeah they're not that great but that's okay i guess um i, I think that's as positive as i'm gonna get i think that's all I have to show you right now. Guys, so it is a Monday and I'm doing my schoolwork. This is the last full week of school that we're actually doing work. It's kind of crazy. Um, so this is where I usually sit. This is my uh, this is my um, classroom, my bed. <laughs> I, I like sitting in my bed with my covers. Sometimes it's kind of hard to focus. Um, sometimes it really works out, really hits the spot. But I just want to talk to you guys for a second because... Um, well, so I just found out, so obviously COVID-19 ruined my, like, I don't know how to put it. It ruined my year of, like, being able to do, like, competitions for my solo. So I usually do six numbers. I usually do six dances all throughout the year. Um, five I compete with, and one I do not compete with. One I just do for a performance. And that would be my ballet production. And the ones that I usually do f for, like, regular would um, be my ballet, would be my lyrical, um, jazz, and tap. Everybody does those three. And then I also do production. And then this year I was supposed to do my solo, too. We did compete one time, but I was only doing my solo for one competition, which I did not end up being able to do. This year I was going to do my solo, but the last couple of years, this fifth number would have been my, um, it's another summer piece that I was not able to do because, um, I was in Italy. And so my mom felt bad and that's why I got a solo. Well, um, that's also happening this time. So we have these three main numbers and then I'm also going to be doing, um, production and then I'm going to be doing my solo from last year, this is, well, this year, I'm going to be doing that in, um, competitions and then i'm also going to be doing a new solo it's going to be either musical theater or sassy jazz i haven't decided yet and then i'm going to be doing you know that number that i said um i was not able to do because i was in italy i'm also going to be doing that one so i'm going to be competing seven dances i'm so excited i'm like freaking out right now i was like so overly excited and then obviously the ballet dance hall so i'm going to be doing eight dances in total i am just i just thought i would tell you guys because i'm like freaking out all right i'm like yay um and yeah i thought i would tell you guys that so i just want to i'll just talk to you guys later bye and these were the cupcakes my cousin made for the drive-by and they look so delicious so i'm gonna dig in hey everyone so it is tuesday now and tomorrow is our last day of school but my but it, today was my brother's moving on ceremony and it was really, it was, I'm so glad that they got to do something because most schools just gave them like certificates or whatever, but my brother had a parade, his teacher, um, talked to all of fourth, talked to all of his, like to all of his class, they, um, they got their certificates, they uh, like had a bunch of signs, and it was really, really nice, and they're going to be doing some more stuff tomorrow, but my mom got us a little bit of like moving on gifts, I guess, like, uh, like graduating gifts, uh, we just got like this little squishy, I got to pick it out, it's this Fuzzy, squishy, you can drag. So, this is quite awesome. I just want to show you guys that right now. Okay, so now let's see like what like, it feels, oh, this feels so weird. This feels so weird. It's it's like such a great texture. I've never feel seen, it? I've never felt a squishy like this. Can I feel it? It like, it's like, oh, like so oh, yeah. weird. Vera's going to get this one, but I ended up getting it, so. Yeah, cause I was like, what if I don't like it? I really like it. It's so cute. It's a little. It's a little sun. That's what it said on the package. It looks like a flower, but it's a sun. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with this. Okay, bye. Hey everyone.
everyone, it is now Wednesday and the last day of school. So I also realized it's the last day of this COVID-19 vlog. I mean, summer vlogs, it's basically going to be the same thing except like no traveling or anything because life is starting to get a little bit back to normal, like step by step, it's starting to get back to normal. So I realized that today is the last day of this amazing vlog. Um, it has five parts to it. It's really crazy. And I'm just so thankful. Um, uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed watching my vlogs. Um, obviously, it's so weird because the last day of, um, the last day of school for me, tomorrow, you're gonna be seeing the first part of this vlog. Um, and it's so weird because I've been filming this forever and ever and ever, and now you're just starting to see it. Um, I've been filming this for about, like, three months now. It is really crazy. So, right now, I'm about to do my last Zoom call, and then I'm gonna be done. Today, I just have a Zoom call to do, um, and then my mom's gonna take a few pictures of us, and then we're gonna go out to dinner for a little lunch, for a little, like, celebration. Oh, and also, remember that squishy that I got yesterday, that, like, super fuzzy one? Well, I was squishing it, and my hands were wet, and all the fluff was coming off of it, and now it's just gross mess, and so if you ever see those in your stores that are, like, three bucks at, like, it's supposed to be the dollar section in Target, but, like, most of it's not even the dollar, but if you ever see that stuff, don't get it. It's not gonna, like, if you end up, like, if your hand's even the slightest bit wet, it's gonna make a big mess, um, and so, yeah, I just wanted to tell you guys that. <laughs> Um, but today was supposed to be, like, a half day at regular school, but I think it's going to be shorter than that because all I have is a Zoom call, and Zoom calls are usually around just an hour, so it's an extra half day. Um, so I've had so much fun with you guys. I'm really appreciative that you've watched all these vlogs. Um, it's a lot of vlogs, um, but thank you guys still so much for watching. Um, bye! Hey guys, so we just did some, um, last day of school pictures. We went to a drive-by to like for my brother to get like a certificate and stuff and right now we're just going to um i don't actually know where we're going but we're in the car i got this refresher from dunkin donuts and it's actually like ombre and it's so pretty it's from yellow to pink and i think i thought it was so cool i've never tried one of these before so this is my first time it's like a taste testing i really like that wow that's strong um but I really like that. Um, I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Hey everyone. So right now we are getting ready to go to our third restaurant for like a celebration of like the last day of school and like all that stuff. Um, so this is our third time going to a restaurant since COVID started. Our second time, because I, I filmed the first time, which is for my mom's birthday. The second time was actually Sunday. And um, we went to uh, like a like a lunch place, I guess. And that's after we ran our first virtual 5K. And we got these big medals. I'll show a picture of them right here. Um, and so basically, yeah, that was really fun. Um, that was tuckering race, but it was, it was really fun. So um, yeah, I'm super excited to go to another restaurant. Hey guys, so right now we are waiting to go into the restaurant. Well, not go in, like sit like outside. You know what I mean though. Um, it's a 45 minute wait, so we're just sitting on a bench and we walked through the whole like marketplace thing and now we're just sitting and waiting and really doing nothing. And I um, marry Yellen with me. Yeah, she forgot her doll. And so that's basically what we're doing right now. I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Okay guys, so this is it. This is the last clip that I'm going to be having in this COVID-19 like series. I feel like it's uh, honestly I'm really upset about it I have really liked it I thought hard like should I keep on doing this like over the summer but I really thought like the whole point of this was like basically like just to survive the school year and like I feel like if I did it over the summer it would be way too long I feel like it should be so short and sweet um even though five clips is five like videos is not short and most of the videos are very very long um and but I feel like if I did it over the summer it would be even longer um so, but even though I'm sad about it, I think it's time that we move on to our summer vlogs. Wait, and those are going to be we, so much fun. Can we tell them the good news, though? Oh, yeah. This is a, a great way to end. I, I thought to myself, there needs to be some sort of finale to this whole, like, COVID-19 videos. And that is... We're getting a turtle! So, in our next... And then um, going to be Crush. Yes, his name is going to be Crush. And in our next... Um, summer vlog 
um, for our first ever vlog, it's basically going to be us getting a turtle, and I'm so excited, guys. Um, I will talk to you guys later. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so, so, so much if you stayed through this whole entire thing. Um, that's, that's amazing, honestly. Um, make sure you comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!